Hi, um, I want to talk a bit about people's feelings during lockdown and the importance during lockdown and activities during lockdown, what you can do at home if you're shielded or if you feel like you need to shield. Um, also, it's really important. And and things you can access during this situation. A, um, this is why I got Susie Oddball, A.K. Hello. My mum. Hello. Um, I'll tell you a little bit about my experience. Um, I run a community radio station called Button Hope Community Radio, and I um have quite a lot of presenters, and some of them are vulnerable, and some of them um, are coping fine. Um. Some of the vulnerable ones I've had to signpost uh, during this time, and this is some of the things I've had to do. So uh, I've had to signpost to MIND, which is a mental health. Do you want to explain a bit what MIND is? MIND is an organisation that helps you with your mental health, and it, it, I have signpost you to other mental health charities and, and places, or um, it has one-to-one -one conversations with you, consultations, and assesses what you need, what are your needs. And if you can phone up Mind, um, it's a wonderful thing to do. Uh, it can help with frustration and uh, all sorts of problems. Um, I've also had to phone up about people's food situation and give them signposts to uh, what to do. And um, one of the places I've sent them to is Brighton and Hove Community Transport. Do you want to explain a bit what community transport is? Well, community transport normally transports people uh, to and fro uh, different places. Uh, older people and people who, who need it because they haven't got the mobility. But during this um, time, they've ha they've actually set up a fresh food bank and they've also set up um, dairy food as well. And you can they set up all, and you can telephone them and they come and to you your can door. do your order by telephone, which is nice because if you can't use the uh, internet, you can do that. And they come to your door and deliver, which I think is lovely. And they've got a lovely persona as well with it. And um, also, the Brighton and Hove Food Partnership has a whole list of different uh, food places. One is the uh, Brighton um, Brighton Junk Project, which actually distributes food, um, cooked food. They cook it and then they distribute it. And they use left uh, leftovers from supermarkets that are given um, to them. And, le and they also have um, a food bank, which you have to be referred to. Uh, so if you're in dire need, you, you can go there and they will help you. Um, but... Do you recommend for people who really, I mean, this is for emergency people who are desperate to, to phone up their doctor if they can. Absolutely. Ask them. I've done that uh, with several different um, people and yourself. presenters. And I've also, when I was confused with information you're, you're that I honest. was getting, because I'm shielding, uh, so I'm classed as extremely vulnerable. And um, I've actually phoned up my GP to uh, verify things and uh, to clarify, to make things clearer, because it's not always clear the information that we're given. So it's good to get that information. And my GP is the best person for me to get that information from. Um, and I do recommend talking to your GP. I, I think other doctors are good and your doctor heard you, but the reason why, because if you keep talking to them, they eventually help you with your need and if you phone up and say I, I need this I'm doing it because of this reason um I think it's good yeah and um positively we're going to talk about activities you can do during lockdown um and also things you can do online things you can do at home and um, as we're talking about accessing um things um if you've got the internet and you're lucky enough and you've got you can do zoom with people speak are doing zoom with people with disability and i noticed they've got a lot more people during the situation it's 
disability and mental health and I um, normally in a normal situation um, do the um, partnership board which I co-share with um, other people and speaker and I really um, I think I really like the um, organisation because they don't just talk about one particular group they talk about other groups and stuff which is good and they've been doing Zoom, um, dropping Zoom. At the table tennis group, I really love the way how they're really, really, like, really technical in the, the way they've been running it during this lockdown. And um, what they've been doing, they put you, um, first of all, they check in and see a bit of thumbs up. And it's not just for people with disability, it's an integrated one. Yeah. And no uh, thumbs up or thumbs down if you've been feeling okay. And then what they've been doing, they do a they do um they do a dancing section with um D and with, and, uh, and the great and the, and the great Chris. That's what you can do. Generally. We've also been doing a caption competition at Brighton Table Tennis and, and we? uh, but also I want I want to give a dedication to um to um Lexi and, and Nikki. Nikki. So I'm really just wanted to say Lexi and Nikki for doing the photography. But I just wanted to say um it's been really brilliant during that bit of lockdown, all of that. It's interesting and it's made me um, made me want to do more um games because it's engaging with the table tennis. And and um what they've been doing and they've been doing the um all of that that's just a sample and we did a cooking section and another sample what Trish has been doing every tuesday she's been doing a women's group because she's tennis. tennis group but she's also a teacher and she goes into schools teaches them tennis. tennis if you need and you if you're a head and you want um, kids to do um, table tennis, but also I want to lock down all of that. Yes. Serena Sussex um, now um, is also doing it uh, at the moment, doing her own through the table tennis, but her own one, Zoom Art, I call it. Serena Sussex Zoom Art, that's what I call it. But, but if you want to access this, be if. If you do have a care or someone coming in, do be warned. You have to put a numbers in just if you need help with that. Because when I first did it, I thought I could do it, but it's harder than for some people than it looks. And some people can do it, but don't give up. And it's really, it's really good. It's been important and it's been funding the activities. And another activity you can do if you're at home you can, and you've got internet and you're good on shopping online, you can buy a colouring in book and it's only two or three quid, same as the pencils, and you can do colouring in, or you can get buy um, just a notepad and do some writing if you can write, or you can do some drawing if you're good at drawing. And if you want, um, you can, from your window you can take pictures of outside um, and also another thing you can do if you've got a garden you can do gardening as my um, mum neighbour's been doing beautifully but she's an amazing gardener she's a good example of what you can do during this situation puts me to shame <laughs> <laughs> now, um, no it's lovely and um, and another thing which my brother um set up with my mum they they got my mum used her um pic, pic garden or garden table as some people picnic table and they got plank of um not like just one slight plank of wood a big chunk of wood to make a table and then what my brother bought online he bought a stretchy table tennis, tennis net. net and to make a to make a net in for the table to uh, play the table tennis and he made sure it's level and stuff so he can play and 
make sure you've got also as well as that a bat and a ping pong ball you need quite a few if you're going to get it over in a neighbor's garden but be very <laughs> careful though make sure and um i recommend amazon ebay and sports direct and also uh, um other places and if you look online you can get some you might be able to go to some sports church shop but if not you can ask some people they might give or lend not give you but lend you some during this situation if you've got anyone who can give you some or lend you some during this situation so um but um, but i think this has been good um during this situation and this is an example of what you can do and the help you need and i hope this has been good this blog so if you like it give a a like down below and a a like down below and a comment.